Hi everyone, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com and in this video I'm going to show you how you can change your margins in Google Docs. So as you can see I have a Google Doc opened up and I'm going to show you a couple of different methods. The first method I think is the easiest because it's right on our screen without going to any menus. We can use the rulers here at the top. If I mouse over the gray area to the right or left of the margin, I can click and I can drag to expand the margin. So we can take it from one inch, as you see on the screen, to say 1.5 inches. So you can see we've moved the margin in a little bit. And then over here, we can take it down half an inch. So right now, I'm gonna click in the gray area. Right now it's at six inches, so we could take it down to 5.5 .5 inches. And so now we have uh, 1.5 inch margins on either side of our page. So I think that's the easiest way to do that. And this will do it to subsequent pages in the document as well. Now, another way that we can do it is we can go up here to the file menu and we can click on page setup towards the bottom of the menu. And from here, you'll notice that we have a section dedicated to margins. So we can specify what we want our top margin to be. So let's say we wanna bring the text a little closer to the top. We can put that at 0.5 inches. We can make the bottom also 0.5 inches. And then let's say we wanted uh, just a real small column of text, we could make the left and right margins three inches. And then we could click OK, and you'll see how our document changed. So we adjusted all of the margins there. Now I do want to show you one more thing. It's a new feature here in Google Docs. So we're going to go back to the file menu, and we're going to go to Page Setup. You'll notice that at the very top we have two tabs, and by default we're in the Pages Setup, which is kind of your standard uh, setup where you have an 8.5 by 11 inch document that you can you know, put text on and send a letter to somebody and that sort of thing. But there's a new feature and that's called Pageless. So if we click on Pageless, you'll notice that Google tells us that the Pageless format allows you to add wide images and tables and consume content without the interruption of page breaks. So let's go ahead and let's try that out. Right now the background color is set to white. I'm okay with that, so let's click OK. Okay, so now you can see it's changed my document. So I have these real wide sides to the document where I can't really put text over there, but I could take an image and I could stretch it out so that it goes beyond the normal borders of the document. So this is good when you're working on like a project and this isn't going to be delivered to somebody in paper format, uh, but you just wanna go outside the margins. I know that that may not have been what you're looking for in this video, uh, but hopefully you found what you were looking for and maybe you learned something that you didn't know yet. If you found the video helpful, I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube. And if you wanna see more technology tips and tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's all I have for you for now. This is Anson from AnsonAlex.com.